All right, now we're moving on to another one of the Nexus series, Panty and Stalking with Garter Belt. This show is nuts. A friend who isn't the same friend I mentioned before recommended I watch this show, so I did, and I loved it. I'm going to go ahead and say this now. This show is not for kids. It is a huge number of adult themes and language. Once again, this show is meant for a mature audience. So with that out of the way, let's get right into this. Story. Not much to say, actually, considering there isn't much of a story, even for a comedy anime. Two angels named Panny and Stocking are kicked out of heaven for being too vulgar. They work with a priest named Garterbell to kill ghosts to get enough heaven coins to get back. And that's just about it, really. Every episode has its own gimmick, with two episodes in one. Characters. Boy, there were some interesting ones here. Uh, let's start off with Panny, since her name comes first in the title. Something you'll notice is that these angels don't seem like angels. That's because they both represent a sin. Panty represents lust. She's quite the sex addict, with the goal of having sex with 1,000 people. <laughs> she likes spicy food, hates sweets, and can be quite the bitch. She can use her panties as a weapon by transforming them into pistols, and has borrowed stockings on occasion for dual pistols. Did I mention this show is Japanese? <laughs> Overall, she's a colorful character with a colorful mouth. Next, there's stocking. Stocking represents gluttony. She loves eating sweet food. She has larger breasts than Panty, is overall much cuter, and can sometimes go into fits of rage. She can use her stockings as twin swords, and is a melt that will make a mother run away in fear, just like Panty. Garter Belt is black. He's also possibly gay? It's never explained outright. Yeah. Then there's the Demon Sisters, Scanny and Nisox. These two are much more sophisticated than the Anarchy Sisters. That's Panty and Stocking. They have a large and intelligent vocabulary, are obsessed with rules, and rarely ever swear. At least, Nisok is not swearing yet. Scanty, however, has. And it was hilarious. Anyway, Scanty has been shown to get excited pretty easily, and Nisox blushes easily. Which is really cute. Overall, I love the Demon Sisters because they were a riot. Finally, there's Brief. Brief, or Geek Boy is somewhat shy kind of guy who has a crush on Penny, but he doesn't have the guts to sleep with her, even though she's pretty easy. He's also gotten into some unfortunate situations, but he was still fun. And that's characters. Next, animation. Like I mentioned in my Gurren Lagann review, Gainix has an unfortunate habit of losing control of their budget. And that's pretty apparent in some moments. You'll notice the animation in some episodes is definitely lacking compared to others. And even though this is a little annoying, I can't bring myself to be mad because of it. In fact, sometimes the low animation is downright hilarious to me. But the rest of the animation is satisfactory. It's nothing that stands out, but I liked it. Some scenes where the difference was purposeful were hilarious just because of the art style. And the overall reactions and all that were enough to make me laugh my freaking ass off. It was a fun ride with a few minor bumps in the road, but it was all worth it. Finally, music. The music was enjoyable. Nothing really great, but still fun to listen to. Then again, a comedy isn't exactly known for its music, but I still liked it. It was okay, but the intro theme is really catchy. Just try getting it out of your head. Overall, the series was a lot of fun. Characters get 9 out of 10, story is 7 out of 10, animation is 8 out of 10, and music is 7 out of 10. The series as a whole gets an 8 out of 10 from me. I'd also like to point out that on my Soul Eater review, I meant to say 8.5 out of 10 instead of 8. Now, um, you might see that subscribe button up there. I'd really appreciate it if you were to click it. And also, make sure to check out my other videos. And check out my supporters. And like this video. And maybe comment. And check out my other anime reviews and all that good stuff. Hope you guys have a great day. And even better tomorrow. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace out, suckers.